Hello everyone, it's Ryan from X Team here. Today I'll be showing you how to fix a problem where the PC keeps restarting when launching Warzone 2. So all you have to do is upgrading the BIOS to the latest version. In this video, I'll be showing you how to do this step by step. First things first, you need this application CPU-Z. The link will be in the description to know what your motherboard is. So mine is Airstroke B450M slash AC. Now go to Google, type Airstroke B450M slash AC BIOS version or your motherboard name if it's different. Don't go to any website, a random website, just go to the Airstroke.com. If you're from Airstroke, go to the main website. Now what you have to do is go to support, BIOS, and here's the latest version. Download global. Once the download is finished, go to your file explorer, uh, downloads, you have the B450M 2.1. Now what you have to do is make sure that you have a USB drive and it is uh, the, the, its file system is FAT32. FAT16 or FAT12. How to check your USB file system? Go to this application, EasyUS. Also, the link will be in the description. Once you open EasyUS, click Start Now, Partition Manager. Here you can know what your USB is. Mine is E on data, it is FAT32. And you can change it. Uh, in this, uh, from this application, you can ch change resize, move, allocate space, a clone, split partition, format, and more. You can format it to uh, uh, NTFS, FAT32, ReFS, XT2, XT3, XT4. You can format it to any uh, thing, any file system you want. So this application is very useful, link will be in the description. Once you get to FAT32, uh, after downloading the uh, application, copy it or cut it, copy it, go to your, uh, your uh, USB drive and paste it. I already have it, I already did upgrade, so just replace it. And here is uh, the, uh, you can delete this, extract the zip here in your USB, so here, show more, extract here. After extracting, you're ready, you're ready to go. Now for the next step. Now what you have to do is restart your PC and spam F2, spam F2 until the PC enters the BIOS. Now you're in the inside the BIOS. Where should you go? Go to Tool, Instant Flash. Uh, don't worry about this, just... You, you wouldn't get this, so... Uh, click, uh, click Yes. And here is the BIOS. The Instant Flash will automatically uh, find your FAT32 USB drive and click update. I already did, so I know I don't need to do this. Now, uh, after after finishing the update, it will see it will tell you to, to uh, press OK to restart your PC. Just click it, and you're done. After you're done with upgrading the BIOS and everything, you can play uh, Warzone 2 without any problem. As you can see, it is launched, you can enjoy the game. As you can see, you can now play the game without any problems. Thank you for watching this video, I hope it was informative, and peace out. Thanks.